welcome back to my channel my lovelies so this is um, obviously I start off with a general reading every day for all of those people who are in a relationship separation state and for those of you who are my single okay so this is just going to be a um, general reading it, you can be any sign to watch this reading it can be air sign water sign fire sign or um, earth sign to watch this okay so i will be starting with this reading guys this is going to be like a pick a card reading of how this person feels about you today what are the intention towards you what for what are they wanting to come towards you so that kind of an energy so this is a very general energy reading and take it as it resonates okay this ca reading can also be watched by the cross watchers if you're watching this yes it would resonate for you also so let us just start off with this reading guys okay the deck that i'm using is uh, the shadows and light deck oracle cards okay i know i will be taking three cards pile number one I know these cards are just too big might be a problem but yes pile number one pile number two and the pile number three and I need to push this basket a little further okay so so this is going to be pile number one pile number two and pile number three so you can be as I told it's for all of you you can watch this reading please make sure to close your eyes and meditate for about two to three minutes before you pick out a pile okay so yes guys if you chose this pile i will be giving you for example like if you are in a committed relationship i will be giving you uh, the message i will be giving you the message before if you're in a committed relationship if you're in a separation state and also if you are single okay i'll be giving you all the three message if you chose any of these piles so make sure to concentrate a bit on the pile and see how this reading goes for you guys and now i will be starting with a pile number one so i will be keeping these both piles somewhere aside and let us start off with the pile pile number one we have glamour intrigue and drama this is how this person views you okay they view you as someone who is very glamorous who is very expressive who is like in the spotlight you're a person that everybody notices you can also be a strong scorpio a strong taurus a strong leo a person that everybody notices as soon as they walk in like when they walk in a crowd everybody notices you say they do view you as someone like that someone who's sure about things someone who is um true to themselves someone who is very in the spotlight that everybody will notice that kind of a person so this person views you as someone famous as someone glamorous someone that everybody will notice in a crowd okay someone where everybody's eyes will go to because you're very sparkly you're very shiny maybe they like your dressing sense or there's something attractive about you that everybody feels that you look good okay so that is what i can say here how this person views you um and this person is someone who is looking at you from a far distance and seeing your true potential so uh, this person may be like acting as if they don't love you or maybe pretending as if they don't care but yes they're secretly like seeing what how amazing you are so this is someone who admires you who sees you from a far distance and notices your beauty but doesn't express that to you guys okay maybe they see how amazing you are but they don't come up to you and they are not expressing how beautiful you are no they're not doing that but obviously this person is from a far distance looking at you and feeling wonderful about how you actually look okay 
so that is again what I can see here my lovely lovely so for those who chose the panel number one this is what I can see uh, for you guys this person is like secretly admiring you secretly watching you from a far distance even if like um, they're not coming and talking to you they're spying on you secretly so i miss you even when you're in the next room so obviously this person misses you as you can see again they're not being direct they're not directly telling you they're not directly expressing their feelings to you instead they are being silent they're being silent and they're not being very expressive about their emotions or whatever it is if you can see that is what i can see for you guys here you care and comfort me when i'm in a bad mood so this even means like this person feels like they need your care because they feel comfortable in your presence they feel comfortable being with you maybe they don't feel so comfortable being with other people and this just makes them feel somewhat different like somewhat good like being with you makes them feel good too because you give them that sense of comfort within their self within their soul or something like that which makes them want you more which makes them need you more in their life so that is what i can say here with these two cards guys so Thank you all so much for joining me here, my lovelies, for those who chose the pile number one. So I'll just explain the overall energy once again and we will be moving on to the pile number two. Okay, so the overall energy for the pile goes like this. This person generally is attracted to you, they love you, they care for you, but at now, like at this time, they are seeing you from a far distance and kind of like watching you from a far distance and saying how beautiful you are how truly amazing you are so i wouldn't say this person hates you i wouldn't say they don't want to be in your presence it goes more like this this person does love you they do want you but maybe they're not sure if they can come towards you maybe like something is stopping them or this just scared that you wouldn't let them in so there can be other insecurities this person's feeling right now so that is doesn't have to do anything with you guys okay all you need to know is this bye guys see you all tomorrow now i will be explaining for your general energies because obviously you clicked on to a scorpio reading or for your own zodiac sign reading so i will be giving you the overall energy for the day because this is just for the gen i mean gen love energies and now i'll be telling how the day would be for you guys and everything about today okay so let us move on to the pile number two now make sure to skip if you don't want to watch for the people who chose the pile number two uh, let us find out Collision of beliefs, style, attitudes, and energies. For those who chose this pile, mostly I can see that maybe your beliefs with this person is clashing, or you have separate thinking, this person has a different way of thinking, and there is a lot of clashing going on between you and this person. I wouldn't say like you guys are different from this person, you guys are totally amazing from this person. No, I wouldn't differentiate your relationship like that. I wouldn't say you're different, this person's different. No, it's nothing like that. Okay. All I can say is that there are different thinking. Like everybody is different, everybody's thought process is different, everybody's perspective is different, and your perspective may be clashing with this person's perspective because like both of your perspective is different from each other's okay and that is the main reason why all of these um strong energies are coming within your relationship if you're not if you're being too blank with this person if you're not able to express yourself to this person even if you express they don't understand you or um, you just feel it is too hard for you to make this person understand things it's because everybody thinks in a different way and maybe this person thinks totally different from you guys okay in that case 
you have to try to compromise or they have to try to compromise so you have to adjust to this situation okay maybe if this person doesn't understand you now doesn't mean they will not understand you throughout their lives no they will understand you at some point but they need to realize that okay only if something happens to them like something happened to you they would understand you guys okay it is for everyone we are all humans we all make mistakes and we don't understand others emotions until the same thing happened to us so the same thing with this person guys you just have to wait for the right time so this is not the time to leave this person and run away no don't do that okay you have to wait for this person and wait till the moment they understand you because that is the moment you will feel the most emotionally connected to that person okay when they understand you when they understand what you're going through okay so wait for the right time i'm not asking you to like pray that karma should work fast or something bad should happen to them no just wait and you will see that everything is going as per the views as per the ideas and everything that the universe has aligned for you guys and for this person okay so that is what i can see here for you with a pile number two let us take some more cards for the pile number two how does this person view you so this person can view you as someone who is a little bit immature or there are people viewing you like that i'm really sorry if that is not what you wanted to hear if you had a choice of being with anyone in the world i would still choose you you are my best friend and i'll always will be you stand at me like i'm the best looking person in the world so this person knows these three things they know that you will never cheat them they know that you're a very loyal person they know that you would always look up to them no matter what and they also know that you're not going to be like others so this person really feel that you need energy within you so they definitely don't feel like you're a different kind of a person they really don't feel like you would leave them they don't have any kind of negative thoughts or they don't have any kind of negative feelings negative thoughts about this relationship with you okay all they're thinking about is how they can come towards you what they can manifest with you what are the things they can manifest in order to achieve this happy relationship with you and yes that is all i can say here with this person guys my lovely my lovely so choose the pile number two okay so this is all i can see here for those who chose the pile number two and yes i hope this reading really resonated with you guys and i hope you like this reading make sure to like comment and subscribe and you can skip on to your uh, daily reading i mean what is going to actually come up for your daily energies daily energies so i will be um it will be after the big god so you can skip to that part and so you can skip to that part and watch for your daily energies what is coming up for you all and stuff and yes guys now i'll be moving on to the pile number three you can watch that too if you are guided otherwise skip to the reading skip to the daily reading okay so thank you all so much for joining me here guys see you all tomorrow bye if you don't want to skip okay so for those who chose the pile number three okay guys so we have transition to the spirit realm so if you chose the pile number three it is all about how your relationship is going to ascend from a normal relationship to somewhere like a twin flame or soulmate connection or like a friendship from a relationship a relationship from a marriage situation from a marriage situation to having kids or that is a lot of improvement in your relationship that is a lot of um development in this connection is what i can see here so um otherwise this can even be like you were never believing in twin flame or a soulmate connection and right now you start believing in those things okay so all i can see here is that generally there is some kind of like uh development to your relationship there's some kind of like a 
focus on what you're going to do what you're going to manifest kind of an energy and that is what i can see here with the transition to the spirit realm card okay with this card so today is going to be um wow this person will even take this relationship to the next level guys or oh, there is some kind of lock towards your relationship the universe is supporting your connection maybe the universe feels you deserve something better if you've got something that is lower than a spiritual connection then maybe uh, the universe will kind of upgrade you into that spiritual energy okay so that is the main reason why you do chose this file this is a more of a spiritual transformation kind of a file more than something it is not something physical it is not emotional it is something phys uh, spiritual that you're getting involved with okay and for this person they are starting to believe in twin flame or soulmate connections they are starting to understand how it is actually what they can do with you what they can manifest with you and everything and yes guys this person is truly going to care for you they're going to love you for who you are what you are they're going to come towards you if they haven't okay to understand you completely to understand how amazing this life can be with you guys okay so now i will be taking out some cards some message cards which will also give you the energies of this person like what are they thinking about you how are they thinking about this connection do they still care for you do they still love you let us just find out my lovely my lovelies those who chose the pile number three we have i learned something new from you every day we are a perfect match i feel comfortable in your arms so with these three cards guys i can definitely see here that this person feels like they are very much attracted to you they very much care a lot for you they would do anything to kind of have this relationship with you and they feel like you match perfectly because everything is aligning up for you guys and the universe is perfectly like supporting you because you're aligned with this person your energies are aligned and this person just feels that you both match perfectly and they want to express how amazing they feel for this connection and maybe they even will propose you and take this relationship to the next level or maybe you might find out that you're pregnant and that will again take this relationship to the next level so this person is just concentrating on improving this connection on giving you what you deserve and i can also see here that i learned something new from you every day with a card definitely what i can see here is that this person sees you even if they're not with you they're seeing you somewhere maybe on social media maybe uh, talking to your friends maybe you have mutual friends where this person is communicating with them to find out about you so this person is getting to know about you they are talking about you every day even if like it's been years since your separation or something like that or it's been months or weeks or whatever it is this person is still talking about you and they're still finding out stuff about you every day in everyday basis and they're learning new things about you they are learning new things which is even helping them to grow on their spiritual journey and that is the main reason if you haven't got back with this person you would come back with them soon because they are having true hope on this connection they're feeling that true vibration that possessive happy energy towards this connection and that is the reason why you will get back with this person guys okay so thank you all so much for joining me here and i hope this energy really resonated with you guys my lovelies uh who chose the pile number three and please make sure to also watch my daily energies i will be doing a daily reading for your daily energies so please make sure to watch that um after this and bye guys see you all tomorrow i see you all in my daily reading bye guys see you all uh tomorrow bye
guys welcome back to my channel my lovely cancers thank you all so much for joining me here and again if you haven't watched my pick a card reading that will be giving you a overall insight into how your situation might be so if you want to check that out please make sure to watch it okay so now i'll be moving on to your general energies my lovely cancers i will just be taking out one more two more cards so what i can see here guys is that cancers it is time for you to respect yourself it is time for you to never let anyone take you for granted never let anyone disrespect you i mean you know your words don't you cancers and please make sure to kind of like you are in that back off kind of energy you don't want anybody who is unnecessarily coming towards you to like make a relationship with you you don't want anyone who would who you know would harm you to do anything in your life so that is a sort of an energy that i can see for you here and today you will be focused on your financial matters and today will be the you are working towards your success you're doing everything for a reason you're manifesting everything for a reason and if you feel like you want to manifest certain things you need to do certain things you're doing everything because you want to you're manifesting everything because you want to okay so that is again what i can see here cancers you guys are planning how to spend your money today it is all about planning so today you might not waste your money you might not um do anything silly because definitely you're very very focused on what you want to do which way you want to go so you're very very focused whether it be on yourself whether it be on the people around you or whatever it is all i can see is a very very focused energy cancers okay so this is what i can see here for you guys my lovely cancers and yes um so now this is all i can see here guys my lovely cancers and for this person they are like they want to come towards you to propose you or they are gathering that courage to speak to you i mean like they want to have true conversations with you and that is the main reason they're coming towards you guys because they've been hiding something for a long time they've been not expressive towards some certain things and right now this person is coming towards you to talk to you about everything to express to you how what they want and how they feel about things and yes when they come talk to you the conversation will be filled with truth and you can obviously like feel the truth in their conversation you might even get angry but uh, finally you will understand that they're being truthful and you would accept them completely okay so this is what i can see here cancers and bye guys see you all tomorrow cancers bye